Continuing to field questions for U.S. Simile, I have a student asking if doing the NBME exams and my PDFs are enough to get you a 240 on 2CK. I know many of you are studying for step one, okay? And uh, I get many iterations of this question. Are the NBMEs and my free high yield PDFs enough to get you a 250, okay, on 2CK as an example, uh, to pass the step one, okay? So I will quickly uh, give you a very solid answer here. So before we get started, please subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. Give the video a like, I really appreciate it. Find me on Instagram at melman underscore medical, M-E-H-L-M-A-N underscore medical, the link is down below. Find me on Telegram, recently created Telegram group and channel, links are down below, now I'll start the clip. So in order to get a decent enough score in the 2CK, a 240, 250, uh, are the NBMEs and my free high yield PDFs enough? My response is regarding the 2CK is because your score is going to matter monumentally now that the step one has gone to pass fail, the answer is no, it's not, a, they're not enough. Uh, you need to get as high of a score as possible and doing UWorld will increase your score, okay? There's there's no room for shortchanging yourself on 2CK. It's not to say some students aren't capable of getting a 240, 250 plus with just the NBMEs and my PDFs, of course, but why wouldn't you take proper measures to get an even higher score? Why wouldn't you? As I said, uh, the bulk of your competition is just going to be your 2CK score. So you need to do not only not only for the 2CK, the NBMEs, the Clinical Mastery Series, NBME Subject Specific Forms, uh, my free high yield PDFs in UWorld. I also recommend doing my audio cue bank here on the YouTube uh, while you're on downtime, brushing your teeth, flossing, uh, commuting at the gym, cooking. Uh, very helpful. That combination, okay? For step one, because it's past fail now, I mean, it's not an overwhelming crisis if you were to get an internal score of a 210 versus a 250. It doesn't matter anymore. So if you're able to, let's say, go through my PDFs, take some NBME exams, your foundation from school is already pretty good. You've done maybe 20% of UWorld and you're like, wow, I'm getting like 240s on these NBME exams offline. Or, you know, uh, you can look at your incorrects, the number of incorrects you get uh, from the online exams because they don't give you numerical scores anymore. Uh, you can use bootleg forms from uh, e.g. Reddit as far as how many incorrects correlate with what numerical score. And you can say, okay, well, I am ready to sit. And that's possible, okay? I mean, that's fine. We got to pass, get you to pass the step one. And then when you get to 2CK, however, no, you can't shortchange it. You should do the full length of UWorld and you should do the NBMEs, the CMS forms, and my PDFs and uh, the audio cue bank on the YouTube, as I said, okay? You know the deal. I'm going to continue making more content. If you like my stuff, subscribe to my channel. And I appreciate your time. That's it.